over to Chief of Detectives Rodney Harrison and then Assistant Special Agent in Charge uh, Daryl McCormick will follow him. Thank you very much. Chief. So good afternoon everybody. Thank you for being here today. Um, this is another case of New York City detectives showing that they're the greatest detectives in the world. An incident that happened in 2002 being solved 18 years later. The relentless, the relentless pursuit to bring this case to justice is absolutely incredible. And it's due to the partnerships that we have, the partnerships that we have with Eastern District prosecutors. I want to thank you for your work. Um, our relationships with ATF, thank you very much. Uh, was able to bring justice to a, a, a case that seemed to be going in the wrong direction, but we were able to get indictments on. Um, I have to take advantage of this opportunity to give a shout out to uh, our cold case squad under Sergeant Dennis Klein, our Queen South Homicide investigators, uh, our detective investigators from the uh, 103 squad, as well as the 105 squad that really initiated um, a positive debriefing that resulted in revisiting uh, this case. Uh, so a lot of work was done by a lot of different men and women uh, involved. Um, me being a native of Queens uh, and being a big fan of Run DMC and Jam Master J, uh, making this arrest was very, very important to me. So once again, I want to thank everybody for coming out, but I also want to thank our, our partners in regards to solving this case. Thank you. Good afternoon, my name is Daryl McCormick. I'm the Assistant Special Agent in Charge of the ATF here in New York City. ATF joined this case in 2016, and since then we've worked diligently with our partners at NYPD and the U.S. Attorney's Office to solve the senseless murder of Jason Mizell, known as Jam Master J. NYPD detectives and ATF special agents employed a wide variety of investigative techniques to uncover the evidence that led us where we are here today to announce these arrests and these indictments. The investigation demonstrates the collaborative commitment that we bring to bring to justice those involved in violent gun crime in New York City and across the country. To the family and friends of uh, Mr. Mizell, who have endured a heavy burden of grief over these many years, we hope that uh, today's arrests and indictments and this announcement will bring some measure of peace, knowing that those responsible will be held accountable. I want to also thank the United States Attorney's Office and the NYPD for the excellent collaborative work and the enormous effort put in by all those investigators and prosecutors in this case. Thank you very much. Thanks, I just wanted to add that Mr. Uh, Jordan will be arraigned by a video teleconference this afternoon. Mr. Washington will be arraigned uh, at a later date to be determined by the court. Thank you for your attention. Email out the press release now and the uh, and the documents to all your uh, media outlets. Three o'clock in three minutes. The arraignment is starting. If you want to call on your phone. Grab our phone.